Hi, I'm Manny Lagos, head coach of Minnesota United. I'm here with Brian Coleman and Brent Coleman, and today we'd like to talk a little bit about dribbling. Dribbling a soccer ball takes a lot of practice. It takes a lot of skill, a lot of technique, a lot of practice. So there's a lot of different ways to do it. There's a lot of different moves to learn. Today, let's just focus on a few of the simple techniques to start getting you to used to touching the ball. So I have Brent here today, and we're gonna focus on a couple things. The first one we're gonna focus on is the inside and outside of the foot dribbling. So Brent's gonna show you that he's gonna dribble a little bit with the inside foot here and the outside of the foot, just nice, nice and lightly touching it and starting to move. So Brent starts to move his inside of the foot, outside of the foot, inside of the foot, outside of the foot, inside of the foot, outside of the foot. That really starts up the tempo. Nice light touches. Notice his balance and how he keeps the ball nice and close to his body. His head comes up. And again, that's a great start of a base to become a really good dribbler. Now you're gonna grab a buddy and you wanna practice controlled dribbling, okay? So again, it's very basic dribbling, but it's really hard if you don't practice it. So you have to make sure that you practice inside, outside of your foot touches, also getting your head up. So right here we have Brent who's gonna shadow defend. He's not gonna to try to steal the ball. And Brian's gonna really work on what we call that controlled dribbling to get his touches down, again, inside, outside of the foot. And as they pick up the pace, you'll see that they have to work on that technique even more and more. Okay, Brian, go ahead. So it goes inside, outside touch, inside, outside touches, good touches, nice and close to his body, and well done, okay? Now Brent takes the ball, Brian gets down low, okay? And he starts going, he starts going fast, inside foot, outside the foot. Notice how nice and close the ball is, and he keeps it right and close to his body. Well done, okay? One more, Brian, let's do it again a little quicker here. Let's see if that ball goes away from you, what happens? Boom, and Brent steals the ball. Again, so working on that nice controlled touches, inside of the foot, outside of the foot, and getting your head up so you can see the entire field will really start a base for you to become a very good dribbler. So a good way to work on that controlled speed dribbling that is so important in soccer is to grab a buddy and create a course where you have a competition and the two of you set up to see who can dribble the fastest but within the constraints of moving around the cones. So where the course is, he has to dribble around the cones. Now the cones are set up in a way that they're kind of just diagonal 45 degree angles but when you get up to this one, you see there's a lot tighter turns. So he's got to decide how fast he wants to dribble the ball, how, like, how his touches need to be nice and light and quick, okay? So it's, a, it's encompassing a lot of things, but it's really working on that controlled dribbling of good, nice touches. Now it's up to you to decide how fast you want to go. If you go too fast, you lose the ball and you're going to lose the, the race. If you go too slow, the other player is going to beat you. Okay, ready, go! Okay, good, nice touches around those cones. Look how fast they're going, but under control is so important, under control. Nice and around, that's a tight turn there, yeah. Well done, look at the speed they both have. Their heads are up and they're finishing, and it's Brian Coleman at the wire. Ready, go! Here we go, nice light touches, nice around the cone. Look how close that ball is to their feet, but they're still going fast. Yep, nice and tight, oh, well done, well done. Good work, boys, good stuff, nice and tight. Nice control dribbling. Finishing up, well done, and time. Brent Coleman is the winner. Okay, so we just worked on some control dribbling, some nice light touches, that good technique of inside the foot, outside the foot, getting your head up. Let's see this happen at the next level.